Hi, this is Beatline15, well, 97 Drummer Boy for this channel, I guess. And today I'm bringing you a small tutorial on how to set up your Logitech USB headset. Now, I've had my headset for a good while. It's pretty good. I have noticed that it makes a small sound in the background. You can probably hear it on the video. Um, but that's not really anything to worry about. I used to use it for PlayStation 3. Um, but then I had an Xbox, so it just kind of straight away from my computer mic if I do some online gaming or anything like that. Or if when I do commentaries for my new channel. I'm going to move away from my mouth a little bit. There we go. But anyways, um, let's get right into it. Today I'm using Camtasia Studio for recording. Um, it's not going to pull up, but it's a nice little program. I downloaded it for free and it screen records and all that good stuff, has a playback and all that and it's I'll put up a tutorial on how to use that too if you want it. I'll leave the link in the description for the free download. Pretty self-explanatory though, it shouldn't need much of a tutorial. But anyways, let's get right into it. Today I'm going to show you how to set up the different sound levels and stuff for your Logitech USB headset. Now, this is so much easier than people probably make it out to be. All you have to do is go over to speakers, right click, go to sounds, this is for Windows 7. Go over here to playback and you'll have your speakers, whatever your speakers are, and the speakers for your Logitech USB headset. Now, if it were default setup, as soon as you plug your Logitech USB headset in and it's all done and worked out, it looked like this and the sound will be playing through your speakers of your headset. Now, I'm going to show you how to set it up if you want it to play through your regular speakers and no sound to come through your headset. You go down to your speakers, set those to default, and go up to your speakers for this, and set those for a communication device only. That's for like Skype or anything like that. Then you want to go over to recording, and I have it set up for my microphone to be recording, not my internal mic. Now, you want to go here, you want to go to properties, general, don't really touch anything in general unless you want to change the name and the icon or anything like that. Go to listen, go playback through this device, you can pick default playback device, speakers, or speakers of your USB headset. If you want to be heard through, if you want the sound to be heard through the speakers, pick speakers, or so on and so forth, you know, etc. Then go to levels, pick out your microphone level that you want. I keep mine a little bit lower because this mic picks up everything. Like I said, $30 mic. Cheap for how good it is. Very good mic. You shouldn't need to mess around in advance. Um, and you press OK. Um, sounds, you shouldn't need to mess around in there. Communications. This is like if you want to mute all other sounds while you're recording or in a call or anything or reduce them by anything or do nothing. But that is really all you need to know. So I'll leave a link to the, the Walmart where you can go and purchase this mic on Walmart.com. I'll leave a link to my new channel, which is B915, like I said. That one's mainly game commentaries, like Minecraft commentaries and stuff. And once I get my capture card, I'll be doing Call of Duty um, and more tutorials and stuff like that on that channel. And then I'll leave a link to the. Camtasia Studio um, screen recorder for you guys. Alright, thanks. Have a good day.